Welcome back to my Minecraft End Challenge. In the last video we found a load of lava and poured a bucket of water over it. And we, uh, yeah, there's a lot of obsidian here now. Definitely enough to make a portal. But I'm not really sure. Uh, right, there's dirt under that one, so that one's safe. Good. Now we only need 10 to make a portal because obviously you can, you don't have to do obsidian corners. You can just put whatever you want in the corners. As long as it's sort of three at the top and bottom. And then, uh four at the sides. Now I'm going to make sure there isn't any, oh, isn't anything underneath these before I dig them out because I don't really fancy dying and losing all my stuff because obviously that would be, you know, a bit of a setback. Uh, there's, right, there's nothing under that one either. Good. At least this lava was like sort of only one deep. I mean I can still hear lava bubbling around me so there probably is lava under some of it, but at least there are some bits where that don't have lava under it because obviously that is helpful. Uh, is there lava behind this? No? Good. Right, this one's fine as well. Good, it's going well. I mean, other than the fact I'm starving, this is actually going fairly well, but I mean, we have got a little farm sort of set up. I mean, it's not a very good farm, admittedly, but still a farm. Right, none of these seem to have lava, so that is good. Course, so so how many is that? One, two, three, four, five. There's five there, so we have nine. Now I just need one more after that. So we won't be here too much longer. But actually, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this, uh, take it back, and make the never portal. But I'm not going to go there straight away. I'm going to come back to this cave and have a little bit of a look around because this cave is only like 10, 11 blocks above bedrock. So there's like good. Good luck like, chance there's going to be diamonds in here, you know. So, I actually don't know if that there's like lava underneath some of this obsidian, or if that is actually the lava to my left, because I think over there a little bit, you can see the light there. There's actually more lava, so it could either be that bubbling, or there could be some lava under this obsidian. But so far, so good. We haven't found like there's not been any lava under any of this obsidian we've been digging up. And let me just check: is there any behind that? No, there's not. Good. Being extra careful because obviously uh, I've got nine experience levels and I've got all this stuff on me as well. I don't want to lose all this obsidian I've already got. That would not be very good. Right, uh, there's nothing there either. Good. So that's the last one we need. Uh, just fill up around this with cobblestone, otherwise, it's going to be a bit hard to maneuver around. And then I'm going to take it back and I'm going to come back and have a little look around. See if we can find any more diamonds, you know, because we still do need. Well, we don't need it, but it would be a good idea to have diamond armor when we went to fight the dragon. So, uh, a little bit laggy. Not really sure why, but it's fine. Get this iron. You can never have too much iron. Right, good. Let's, uh, I don't want to risk going in the cave and dying from, like, creepers and stuff. So, what I'm going to do is... Gonna, why does this keep making me come off? Stop it. Annoying computer. Keeps making me, like come off the screen so like when I'm pressing the buttons it's digging at me because it's saying I'm not selected Minecraft weird thing anyway let's take this back because I don't really want to explore the cave with all this stuff on me in case I die and uh, I'll come back down here I'll leave the obsidian the diamond pickaxe and all that stuff I'll probably just come down here in armor with a sword and an iron pickaxe see if I can find anything not really sure why the frame rate is so crappy I mean it's not actually well actually no it's not that bad it could be a lot worse but a little bit jolty. Uh, actually, I'm not sure. <laughs> According to Fraps, it was just doing 90 frames a second, and now it's on 30. So really, it shouldn't be that jolty. But I suppose Fraps could be wrong. I need to make a fishing rod, which I actually could do because I need to catch a fish. I could get one of them. I'm not really sure if they could come to the end of you, but worth a try. Um, right, what do I need? Uh, well, I want to make a fishing rod. So if I get that stuff out, but uh, I'll keep that out to put in the furnace. Put that away, put all this stuff away. Yeah, just gonna have to put it in this chest, there's not enough room. Uh put all this away. Keep the torches on me. Right, let me just make a uh, fishing rod. So for that I'm gonna need a f think is Oh god, I don't know how to make a fishing rod actually. Is it There we go, right, fishing rod, good. Catch a fish and then get a little uh, pet on our side. Put this stuff away that I don't need. Uh, that needs to go in the furnace. 
As well, a fishing rod would probably be a good idea because there's no animals around other than uh, cats and some sort of weird invisible chicken. So, I mean, it probably would be a good idea to make, um, well, I've already made it now, but I mean to have a fishing rod because then I could go fishing. And obviously any fish I catch, I can cook them up and eat them. And obviously I'll give a raw one to one of the cats and hopefully they'll be my friend. Come on, fishies. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Come on! Stupid fish. Ugh. Well, this is exciting. I'm sure you've probably all clicked on a different video by now. Come on! God damn it, fish. What is your problem? Do you need to put bait on fishing rods now? Last time I played this, you didn't, but I'm not really sure. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, I'm, I'm going to click off this. Well, not even on the video I'm recording. I'm going to click off this game in a minute. This is boring. Come on. Oh, you know what? Whatever. We're, we're not bother fishing. We'll just go see what the farm's doing. See if I can get some food from there because this is just stupid. Uh, looks like one of them's grown. Of course, that's good. Wait, let me let me try fishing again. Maybe maybe I've stayed further away so the you know, fish don't get scared. Maybe they made it real realistic. Come on, bob underwater. I'm gonna give it ten seconds. Ten, nine. Oh crap! We didn't was it quick enough? Oh god! All right, ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight. Wait, actually, no, 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 no. That was too close to the ground. There we go, fish. Okay, good. We've got a single fish. We'll cook that up and have a little munge out on that fish. In a minute when we get back, we'll take this wheat, which actually I don't think is grown. No, it isn't, for God's sake. Oh, <laughs> well, that's fine, whatever. We've got a fish, so who cares? Right, yeah, so cook this fish up so that we can actually get back to full health, and then I'll go explore the cave for a little while, see if I can find some diamonds. I mean, hopefully I will, because obviously, as I say, I need diamond armor. Well, I don't, again, I don't need it, but I'd prefer it to fight the dragon. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Did I just close the door? No, it was just a coincidence. Right, get this. I swear I only put four in there. Oh, well, I'm not complaining. Right, um, get these iron bars out. And I'll put sticks somewhere. Where are they? There they are. So there we go. Right, we can make... Wait, what was we making? Oh, yeah, an iron, iron pick. Oh god, I'm putting sticks all over the place. Here we go, iron pickaxe. Right. Oh, I've actually got a bit of rotten flesh there that I could actually eat. Not the best, but you know. Right, cook that fish. Uh, put these sticks away. Put this iron away. Arrows, fishing rod. Right. Do I actually have armor on? Yes, I do. Okay. Right. Cool. Cook fish. She would get delicious fish. Okay. Eat that. They gave me two. Uh, please go away, hunger. Come on. That's okay. Three seconds. Right, I should. Now. Now. Yeah, there we go. Right, I'm not hungry anymore. Uh, good. I should start getting some health back. Right, let's go back down here. Is it down here? I have no idea. Oh, yeah, it was. It was. It was all the way down the bottom and then to the left. And then it went up a bit. And, yeah. Anyway. Let's go there, uh, see if we can have a little bit of a look around, find some diamonds maybe, uh, and then obviously probably won't have time in this episode to do a nether portal, but I will make a nether portal in the next episode. I mean, hopefully the nether portal will take us to a good place, like where there's a nether fortress nearby, but I mean, obviously I'm not psychic, I don't know, but I'm hoping I will, won't get a dodgy nether spawn for once, like usually I get the ones where you just spawn a little cave that goes nowhere, but hopefully I won't get that to in the next episode. Why am I not regenerating health? Hmm. Maybe you need full health uh, food bar. I don't know. Anyway, let's have a bit of a look around. Right, what have we got in here then? We got some la Oh, you know what? I can make some more obsidian. If I do that. Ah. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Right. Let's put <laughs> we're going to have to put a torch down now though because it got really dark. Right, I'm going to have a look up here, see if I can find anything. It just looks like there's a load of water up here, to be honest. But let's uh, put this torch down. A little bit laggy. Okay, anything? 
not a bad amount of iron. It's good, I suppose, in case, you know, my uh, iron arm gets broken. At least I'll have a backup. Oh, there's a little bit more here. I, hope, I think that's, yeah, I was going to say that probably will go back a bit. There ain't just going to be two bits of iron. Quite a lot, actually. There's, that was eight, maybe nine. I'm not sure. Anyway, good. Oh, there's more here as well. There's iron everywhere in this cave. Okay, right. Good, 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 good. Right, we've got enough coal. We've got like 50 in the furnace, so we don't really need coal. Uh, oh, God. Oh, good. There was water there. I think that would have probably took me down to one heart, which obviously wouldn't have been good. Oh, that's the point. I've got to be careful with falling damage and stuff in here. I uh, have to make sure extra, take extra care of where I'm walking. Oh, God. I thought I was going to fall then. Had to lag just as I was jumping, didn't it? Right, we've got. What we got here? We've got water. Oh, I think this is actually a ravine. Looks like it. Right, there's gold over there. Got some coal around. I oh, should be okay if I land there. Yep. Right, this is actually a big ravine, so that's good. Uh, probably should have brought my bucket of water because I can't actually get anywhere now. Oh, wait, I can swim up here. Just break physics. No problem. Do you imagine how strong you'd have to be? I don't, I don't think it's physically possible to swim up a waterfall. And even if it was, you'd have to be so strong to swim up water coming down. I mean, I know obviously you can... No, I, don't, I don't think that's possible, to be honest. I'm pretty sure it's not. Why Notch thought he'd put it in his game, we'll never know, but... I know for a fact it's not possible in real life. I just realised I probably should have killed the skeleton first because they're really accurate and I'm going to die. No! Oh, crap. Uh, I really need to make a bed. I keep spawning in this tree. Oh, God. Died again. Well, this is looking this is looking good, really, isn't it? I mean, I, if I'm dying against a single skeleton and a creeper, how exactly am I supposed to beat the Ender Dragon? Well, hopefully I'll... Yep, I thought I might. I thought I was gonna land on the beach then. Uh, I suppose I could go and get my stuff back. I mean, it wasn't exactly a lot. Well, actually, it kind of was. It was a full set of armor, but oh god, do I have enough to make another set? I can't really keep just making. Using, oh, I need four more bits. Um, well, it's a good job I left my diamond pickaxe here, really, and otherwise that'd be gone now. And the obsidian. Um. How long have I got? I've got two minutes. So I think we could maybe pull that off. Oh, I just realised at least I'm not hungry anymore. That's a good thing about dying. Well, you know, on Minecraft anyway. I mean, dying in real life probably... I mean, yeah, if you died in real life, you wouldn't be hungry anymore, but... You'd be dead, so... Yeah. There's, there's only really an upside to dying on Minecraft. It doesn't really work in real life. <laughs> Uh, um, right, I think we could probably make this. Probably got a bit of a concussion, just head by the sea in all them times, but that's fine. Let's do some mega jumps, get down this tunnel really fast. Right, I mean, hopefully I can remember where I went. Now, I think right, I went up here. If I can actually get up. There we go. Right, we went up here. Uh, come on, I've only got like, I think literally if I go over 15 minutes my stuff will be gone anyway, so I've got like a minute left to get it, so then we went around here, up here, come on, you know, I'm going to take the safe route round. right, come on, we can do this, we can get our stuff, we can hear a lot of things, right, uh, we sw oh, it's up there, it's just there, it's just there, come on, we can do this. So I remember we broke physics to get up here, so let's do it again. Hopefully it won't be too much stuff. Come on, you can make it. You can make it. There it is. Okay, right, the creeper and the skeleton are both gone. Good, all my stuff's here. Oh, look at that, got our stuff back. Oh, good, right, I was just going to leave it, but I thought, no, you know what? I won't, I'll go get it. Good, we've got our stuff back, and we've got quite a bit of cave left to explore. But for now, I'm going to leave it there for today. 
So yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button. Maybe even add the video to your favourites. And if you really want to help me out and help the channel grow, then you could add the video to your... Uh, oh, wait a minute, nope, wrong bit. You could share the video on Twitter and Facebook. I already said the favourite bit. Just don't know why I said that again. Anyway, not important. As I was saying, yeah, you could share the video on Twitter and Facebook. And all that stuff would help massively. And I'd appreciate it so much if you could do any of that stuff. And uh, yeah, so... That's all for today. So again, thank you so much for watching and as always I will see you in the next video and goodbye.